in need of backup. Hey, Agent. Thank you for saving my ass last night. We need to bring you up to speed on Anderson and Sokolova's new alliance. Go ahead, Fred. General Anderson's true sons are embedded with the Black Tusk and have been helping Sokolova increase her fleet of hovercrafts in D.C. After Coney Island, I'm concerned about potential mortar strikes. First up, Charles Trunks Crawford. Ex-Navy, pure sadist. An engineer by trade, he has control issues and very little respect for the sanctity of human life. Lieutenant Banton. Used to be a drone operator for the Army. He believes he isn't responsible for someone's death unless he gets their blood on him. Banton will tell you he's never killed anyone because he's never had blood on his hands. But he's murdered thousands. Mort Cursed Kellogg. This guy has the worst luck. Rumor is he is a compulsive gambler. Got into debt with the wrong people and enlisted to try and pay back the loan sharks. They say he won the lotto on Black Friday and couldn't collect his winnings. Pretty sure loan sharks are the least of his problems now. Beatrice Auntie Kaplan. I know her as Petty Officer Kaplan. She killed a guy during basic because he called her Auntie. You kill a guy for giving you a nickname, and then you make everyone call you that so they never forget what happens to people who mess with you? She's petty and dangerous. And last but not least, Zachary Stovepipe Beatty. I hate this guy. He thinks he's untouchable. He used to be an explosive ordnance disposal specialist. Pretty sure it was just an excuse to blow shit up, since all he ever does now is blow shit up. Frankly, I don't trust men that pretty. They always get away with too much shit. Stovepipe and his team are heavily armed, ruthless, and know every inch of this city. They know where to strike to do the most damage physically and psychologically. Good luck tracking them down. I look forward to working with you, Agent.